This Canana air intake system was designed to increase vehicle power and acceleration by reducing restriction in the intake path. The Canan 77-3071KS air intake system fits 2010 and 2011 Chevrolet Equinox and GMC terrain models with 2.4 liter engines. The 77-3071KS air intake system is not legal for highway use in California or other states adopting California emission standards. Check KNFilters.com for up-to-date information on emissions legality, for specific parts on specific vehicles, and for a list of other carb adoption states. k and power testing showed an estimated power gain of 9 horsepower at 4600 RPM with the 77-3071KS air intake installed on a 2010 GMC Terrain with a 2.4 liter engine. Actual results will vary depending on the condition of the vehicle, mileage, weather, and other variables. With the air intake installed, we ran the vehicle on the dyno to test the sound comparison versus the stock intake. The intake kit includes components that have been designed or matched to the needs of these vehicles to produce a safe horsepower increase. Detailed installation instructions are included with this kit. The tools needed for this install are shown. Turn off the ignition and disconnect the negative battery cable. Disconnect the mass air sensor electrical connection. Disconnect the crankcase vent tube from the intake planum. Loosen the four screws that secure the upper air box to the lower air box. Loosen the hose clamp securing the intake planum to the throttle body. Remove the intake planum and upper air box from the vehicle. Remove the air filter from the lower air box. Remove the crankcase vent hose from the valve cover port. Install the provided filter adapter into the K&N upper air box and secure it with the provided hardware. Install the K&N air filter onto the filter adapter and secure it with the provided hose clamp. Set the K&N upper air box assembly onto the factory lower air box. Remove the four upper air box retaining screws from the factory upper air box. Secure the K&N upper air box with the four screws removed in the previous step. Install the provided silicone hose onto the throttle body and secure with the provided hose clamp. Remove the two screws securing the mass air sensor into the factory air box, then remove the mass air sensor. Install the mass air sensor into the K&N intake tube and secure it with the provided hardware. Install the provided vent fitting into the K&N intake tube. Install the provided silicone hump hose onto the K&N intake tube. Install the K&N intake tube assembly onto the filter adapter. Using a twisting motion, push the intake tube into the silicone hose until the tubes line up with the silicone hose on the throttle body. Secure the intake tube with the provided hose clamps. Install the provided crankcase vent hose onto the port on the valve cover and then attach the open end onto the vent fitting attached to the intake tube. Reconnect the mass air sensor electrical connection. Reconnect the vehicle's negative battery cable. Double check to make sure everything is tight and properly positioned before starting the vehicle. It will be necessary for all k and high flow air intake systems to be checked periodically for realignment, clearance and tightening of all connections. Failure to follow the above instructions or proper maintenance may void warranty. k and makes products for nearly every vehicle on the road. The k and website allows you to search products by vehicle or dimension, download installation instructions, view dyno chart showing estimated horsepower gains for this product, and view product details. For information on where to buy k and products, go to knfilters.com.